Hey everybody, today I just wanted to shoot you a little bonus video because I'm making my salads for the week and I thought you might be curious to see how I do it. So I divide it up into two days typically. Uh, yesterday we went to the market, got all the groceries. I also cooked a huge vat of chickpeas. I cooked a lot extra because I'm going to make some hummus, I'll probably make some chickpea cookies, whatever I have left over I will freeze uh, in the cooking liquid. I also roasted some sweet potatoes which I just uh, scrubbed, coarsely chopped, and baked on convection at 425 for about 30 minutes until they were tender. And I also washed up a bunch of romaine lettuce and a bunch of kale. So now today, all I have to do is sort of chop everything up and then portion it out into my containers. Uh, before I get to chopping though, I just wanted to say that, um, I think I mentioned it before, but romaine will sort of get brown if you chop it with a steel knife. So rather than chop the romaine, I'm just going to tear it, but I'm going to shred the cabbage and chop the kale. All right. Now we've got uh, the greens, the beans, some roasted veggies, and now I'm just going to chop up some fruit and add some uh, nuts and cranberries. All right, so that's it for the salads. They're pretty uniform, but you can see there's like a little bit of variation to keep it interesting throughout the week. And now that these are all done, I'm just gonna do a quick kitchen cleanup and then I'm gonna make a dressing for the week. All right, so I always like to have an all-purpose sauce on hand, and this is one of my favorites. It's just a really simple tahini and lemon juice dressing. And tahini is great because it's rich, it's satisfying, but it's also a whole food. You've got uh, raw, unholed sesame seeds ground up, and they're a great source of calcium, and so you're getting a little bit more than just fat. You're getting like a really nutritious fat with this dressing. Um, so we're just gonna measure a half a cup of tahini. So this is a sauce that you can use, obviously, as a salad dressing, but you could also use it to like drizzle over pasta or a burrito like it's um, you can really customize the flavor however you like based on what seasonings uh, you add to it so a half a cup of tahini followed by a quarter cup of lemon a 
Of course, you can add more to taste. Then we've got a quarter cup of water. And we're going to do um, two tablespoons of, here I've got Bragg's amino acids, but tamari would work well also. You could do soy sauce, but it might be a little bit saltier. So if you do soy sauce, maybe tone it down a notch. And then after that, we're adding so it's like a teaspoon of cumin and a teaspoon of like a half a teaspoon maybe of turmeric. And then if you want to make it a spicy sauce, you can throw in some cayenne. Or if you want to make it an herby sauce, you can throw it into a blender and add some dill or parsley or whatever you like. But I'm just going to pour this into the container that I'm going to store it in and then lid it and shake. And that's it. You got a great dressing for the week. If it's too thick, um, depending on where you're at and your tahini, you might have really thick or really thin tahini. So add more water or lemon juice if you need to to thin it out. Uh, or if it's too thin, add more tahini. And that's it. This is going to stay good in the fridge for at least a week. So I hope you enjoy this video. Good luck with whatever it is you're prepping this week. And I uh, hope to connect with you soon.